<laughs> Greetings Cancer and welcome to your horoscope. So, this is the deal. We are in a place right now where um, friendships count a lot. And so, it, make more friends. You know, be a little bit more social. Yes, the thing, that, one of my favorite things to say to my cancer friends is, get out of your shell. <laughs> what is it about us water signs that we, you know, we are somewhat naturally recluse, I guess, because we're so sensitive. Yeah, but we're so amorous, too, though. We love love, so, you know, you, you aren't going to get good love watching soap operas staying at home, I'll tell you that. And so you were really busy, you had in the past weeks lots of going on career-wise, but this is your, you know, this is your social time, this is your time to cultivate good friendships. And um, it's also a time to prepare for the future, where you get a good vision of the future, and you're able to actually organize parties, organize meetings, and a lot of your good fortune and good kar karma, where you make yourself a better person, that's happening right now. That's pretty nice. I mean, we all we all can feel good about that. Okay, so we start the week weekend, I should say, Friday, with that nice Scorpio moon making you feel really creative and loving. So that's helping you right there. And um, you know, it's uh, working for a charitable cause or working with a group over the weekend, as we've got you know the moon going through your sixth house. And then Monday, Tuesday, it could be an office-inspired romance. I don't know. It, it, something could happen. You could suddenly fall in love again. But um, most of all, things are pretty free-floating. And you're really still focused on improving your spiritual life. There's nothing wrong with that. You know, I, I salute you for that. 